Hi, Saki here from Saki Tech. In today's video, I will show you how to transfer all your photos from your Android smartphone to your newly purchased iPhone. This is the most fast and easy method available without needing a PC or a Mac. Now, there are a few requirements which are as follows. Number one, you need an iPhone 5 or later. You need iOS 9 or later running on your iPhone. And number three, which is also the most important, this method only works on a fresh iPhone, meaning we are assuming you just purchased an iPhone and you are turning it on for the first time and you're about to go through the initial setup process as you can see on the screen. If you want to go back to the initial setup screen, go into settings, go into general, scroll all the way down on your iPhone, tap on reset, and you're gonna to have to erase all content and settings of the iPhone, which is gonna take you back to the initial setup screen as if you were going to set up your iPhone for the very first time. But beware, because this is going to delete everything on your iPhone. All right, so let's start with step number one. Go to the Play Store, and what I want you guys to do is search for the app called Move to iOS. Tap on it once you find it, and go ahead and install this application because we are going to be using this application to make this transfer possible. It's by Apple, this application. Now on the iPhone, let's get started. Let's uh, continue with the setup process, the initial setup process. Choose your language, your country, uh, choose a Wi-Fi network, which I already did. Uh, enable location services. Uh, we're gonna skip the basic stuff for now. So let's just skip all this. I just want you guys to see everything. Skip the passcode and continue okay and this is the screen this is the magic screen we have been waiting for okay so switch back to Android and click open to the move to iOS app so we can launch this application uh, click continue on the application agree to the terms alrighty and then on the iPhone choose where it says move data from Android tap that and then click continue again which is gonna give you a code. Now click next on your Android phone. Click next and type in that code that you see on the iPhone. And leave everything else to automation. So it's gonna to connect to your iPhone right now. The Android phone is connecting to the iPhone as you can see. The connection is complete. They're using the Wi-Fi network obviously. And after 10 to 20 seconds, the connection should be complete. And there we go. So we have the options to transfer other stuff as well. But today, we're going to be working with the camera. So uncheck everything. Make sure the camera roll is checked. And once that is complete, you have to click Next on the top of the Android smartphone. And as you can see, Move to iOS has been initiated. Okay, let's just see this through. And boom, transfer complete on the Android end. So you can actually put that phone aside if you want. Just click done, uh, exit the application, whatever you have to do. And now we simply have to wait for the iPhone to get done. It says transfer complete, continue setting up the iPhone. And of course, we're going to just skip this uh, little things for now. So just set up later in the settings. Don't use. I just want to show you guys that the photos have in fact been transferred over. Agree. Uh, set up uh, Siri later, tap it, don't send, choose the standard view, just click next, there we go, welcome to your iPhone, go to photos, and boom, there's the five photos that we were trying to transfer from our Android phone, and of course, this is simply an example, we only did five photos, but you can do the same process for 500 photos, a thousand photos, you just have to you know, be patient because the transfer is going to take longer. But this is an absolute fantastic way to transfer photos from Android to iPhone, especially when you're initially setting up your iPhone. You do not need a computer at all, no USB cables. Everything is done wirelessly via the Wi-Fi network. And that's all. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and I'll see you the next time.